First, take out of all items from the package. The package includes monitor, camera, DC power cord, U bracket, cigarette lighter adapter, antennas, T taps and screws. Pick up the camera. Install the antenna on the camera. Pick up the monitor. Install the antenna on the monitor. Please note, both antennas must be installed on the monitor at the same time. Pick up the camera. Tear off the protective film on the camera. There are four IR lights. Install the sunshade on the monitor. Align the bracket hole with the screw hole. Follow my operation. Align the spacer with the screw hole to protect the monitor from being scratched. Follow my operation. We need to use some screws to fix the bracket. Follow my operation. The bracket can be flexibly adjusted. Pick up the power cord. Connect the power cord to the monitor. Pick up another power cord. Connect another power cord to the camera. Now merge the two thin red wires. Then merge the two thin black wires. Pick up the green connector. Use a tool to loosen the screw. Insert the merged red wires into the positive, plus slot of the green connector. Insert the merged black wires into the negative, slot of the green connector. Tighten the screws. Please don't let the positive and negative electrodes touch. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the green connector. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power outlet. Press the red button. The monitor lights up and the image appears on the screen. The testing finished. Now disconnected all the wires. The easiest way is connect the monitor to cigarette lighter outlet. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power outlet. Press the red button. The black wire is connected to the negative of the tail light or 12 VDC power system. The red wire is connected to the positive wire of the tail light or 12 VDC power system. The image appear on the screen. Now introduce the function of the monitor. Press the power key to turn off, on the screen. Press the up and down keys does not respond in this case. Press the CH key to switch to the CAM2 channel. Press the CH key again to switch to the CAM3 channel. Press the CH key again to switch to the CAM4 channel. Press the CH key again to switch to the quad mode. Press the CH key again to switch to the CAM1 channel. Press the menu key to enter the menu mode. Press the menu key again to quit the menu mode. When you insert the SD card, press the SEL key to turn on, off the recording function. Press the menu key to enter the menu mode. The first key is used for pair signal. Press the up or down key to switch to the picture. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the SEL key, the icon turns red. Press the up or down key to adjust the brightness. Press the SEL key to confirm. You can adjust the contrast or hue. 
Press the menu key to return to the previous interface. Press the up or down key to switch to the mirror flip. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to select the mode you want. Press the menu key to return to the previous interface. Press the up or down key to switch to the mode. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to select the split mode you want. Press the menu key to return to the previous interface. Press the up or down key to switch to the cam setup. Press the SEL key to confirm. You can turn on, off the camera you want. Press the up or down key to switch to the auto scan. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to turn on the auto scan. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to switch to the SCANTIME. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to adjust the scan time. Press the SEL key to confirm. Presses the menu key to quit the menu mode. When the scan appear on the screen, the system will automatically switch the camera channel. Press the menu key to enter the menu mode. Press the up or down key to switch to the system. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the SEL key. The icon turns red. Press the up or down key to adjust the system time. Press the SEL key to confirm. The second icon is used to switch the language you need. Press the up or down key to switch to the P line. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to turn on the guideline. Presses the menu key to quit the menu mode. The guideline appear on the screen. When the guideline appear on the screen, press the up key to move the guideline up or down. Press the down key to move the guideline left or right. Follow my operation. Press the menu key to enter the menu mode. Press the up or down key to switch to the play. Press the SEL key to confirm. When you insert the SD card, your recorded video will be saved here. Presses the menu key to quit the menu mode. Press the menu key to enter the menu mode. Press the up or down key to switch to the record. Press the SEL key to confirm. You can turn on or off the rewrite function and format the SD card. Presses the menu key to quit the menu mode. Now it's CAM2 channel. Press the menu key to enter the menu mode. Press the SEL key to enter the pair countdown. Connect the camera to the power. The image appears on the screen, indicating that the pairing is successful. The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line T-taps T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole. camera power cord. Plug the power cord into the second hole. Iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom. 